Cohen shoves. Dance. Dance. Now, every single time we've seen this happen. Come on, baby. Cohen has had it, and he has somehow gotten his opponent to call. And Cohen oh, elects just to call from what the big blind. Call. Now it's sexy. Sexy, sexy call. Sexy call. Sexy, sexy call. Ah, excuse me. This movement is called sexy call. Sexy. I am the sexy. I really like this call. Oh, sexy. <laughs> you are the sexy check. Oh, pardon. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> you can't make your sexy check until James sexy. is checked. <laughs> no good for you, this. You will raise, you re raise, I am re raised. Ah. Oh, two flush draws out there now. James looking for a diamond, Cohen looking for a spade. Tonka still with the best hand with pocket eights. Good. No, he's not folding. Yeah. But Tonka, not to say that you should. Tonka has folded the best hand. Yeah, queen oh. oh! Solid fold by Tonka, because Cohen gets there on the river. Oh. And James deciding to bet river with ace high, with the missed draw. Whoa. And there is the red triangle. So there is the all in from Cohen. That's a bluff. That's a bluff. Celebrates. Oh, yeah, That's yeah, a bluff. Yeah, yeah. I am the best. That's a bluff. <laughs> I am the best. I, no, no, no. Look after. Ah. <laughs> I, I, I am the crazy. Clap. I am the crazy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Rats yeah, off yeah, to yeah. you. Cohen with ace king opens from the cutoff. One EPT Deauville back in red 2011. Man. Uh, this is an all-in, right? Eight big blinds, pocket eights. I like the synergy. All in. There it is. Well, he's going to get called in at least one spot. Oh, Ooh, Fabian with ace queen. Oh boy. Fabian reshoves. Ooh. Action oh, back on Cohen, hey, cool, cool. who yeah. calls. Whoa. And bad, Lucien bro. Cohen only... has Look both it, players it, covered it, here. Oh, wow. Good luck, so if Cohen gets there, hey, double KO alert. Right, man. <laughs> the flop is oh, queen, no, jack, nine, seven. Ten, 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 ten. Worst ten, to first. Ten, ten. So Fabian uh, well, has like taken the lead. With this flop. Domination Eight rotation. Diamond could be good for me. Yes! The 10 gives the yes! right man the straight. Yes! <laughs> 10, je dis. <laughs> Sorry, what? Yes, yes, yes! Oh, and that you? is a double <laughs> KO. What did I call you? No. Ace King, who was man? What can they call you though? Yes! <laughs> tu sais le faire, toi. Lucien Cohen has raised from the cutoff. <laughs> He's made it 1.2 million. Blind still 250, 500,000 right now. Well, still got 30, 33 minutes to run on this level. 10 9 off is the hand. Tilka defending the big blind with King 4 off. And it's a King high flop. 22. Oh, I thought you begged more, sorry. I thought you begged like 30. That's why I said sitting up. Cohen continuing for 1.3, gets called by Tilka. And Cohen now picks up a straight draw on the turn. It's open-ended. Equity increases to 21%. Action goes check, check. The river is a jack, Ooh. and that means Cohen gets there. Runner, runner to make the straight. Tilka still with top pair. And he's going to lead into a pot of 5.75 million. Marcos Tilka bets 1.5 million. Look at that. He's sniffing the beans. And a quick raise from Lucien Cohen. Raised it to 8.5, and Tilka looks confused. 
I am the right man. <laughs> I know oh. we have the benefit of seeing all the hold cards. But Lucian Cohen How much? doesn't it seem like he gets out of line like this, it's, right? It's, <laughs> Massive river like, raise. You've yep. got top pair, bad kicker. It feels like a frustrating, but a pretty easy fold. Andrew on Twitch asks, has Cohen bluffed at all today? Right he, he checks it down when he's weak. I don't know yet. I am the king. You are the king. Do you have checks? Yes, I am Jack. Do you have checks? One Jack. Two, no two. One Jack. One Jack. With a king. A no king. <laughs> <laughs> you sure no king? I'm look after. No pay and look. I mean, he's screaming fold. He's telling you everything. Any player at the table is entitled to do that. And that's a call. Ooh, Teal no Heroes with a king gets shown the nuts. The former professional exterminator, the so-called rat man, wins a huge pot there. Cohen is back in the mix. Min raise with kings. Smadga. Now, I will hearken back now for a moment, James. We saw Smadga flatting Jax previously, decides that he's going to do the same again now. Karadimos has a great spot to squeeze. Ace nine suited would just be like an absolute glory, absolutely glorious situation. Probably not anticipating that Jacks are going to be flatting here too often. It looks like that's where we're headed, though, guys, and I appreciate this move. So, yeah, obviously, you look at this in isolation and think, Jack's Kings could get it in here, but what on earth is happening here? Yeah, James. I Lucian Cohen just flatting the three bet? I was about to say, if there's ever a guy that's flatting Kings, it's this guy right here. And that means Smadger will flat with the Jacks as well, and will go three ways to the flop. I was going to say, Nick, that Tonka having only six big blinds is going to stop Kings versus Jacks getting it in here, but the Karadimos factor has also thrown the natural order of things out of balance. Yeah. And we do have two clubs on the flop. Ooh. Got two over pairs to the board, plus we've got the nut flush draw. It's all kicking off. Yeah, I mean, just notice how Cohen's body language changes as soon as he's actually in a serious hand though, right? You know, not nearly as chatty, not singing, no rap, man. Karadimos continuing for 2.5 million. Very quick call from Lucien Cohen with Kings. And Jax. It is the James and Joe, by the way. The JS and the JH. And Smadger decides he's going to call as well. And we are still three way to the turn. Wow. 19.8 million in the middle. Smadger has about half pot behind. Yeah, this is really interesting. No club, deuce of hearts, about as bricky as it gets. And Karadimos, does he want to fire again? No, checks it back. River card is the king of hearts. It is top set for Cohen. And it's the nuts. And he quickly checks. And no one bets into him, and he's so frustrated. How are you ever going to let him play? How are you ever going to let him play? You're on so bad. Nobody's out. Guys, come on, be reasonable. E3 bet. You guys have kings and jacks. Somebody go all in. No look, no look, no look, and check down. <laughs> no with me. Look, look. Oh my friend. Oh my friend. Uh, I'm cold. 
And we're gonna have just a call from Cohen. Gonna slow play the Queens. Look forward to seeing three checks here. Ten high flop, there's check number one. Vilasevic is gonna feel compelled. And Cohen makes the call. No, no. I'm tilt. Smallish seabed. Oh, wow. And we've got two checks. There's check number two. A jack on the turn. I mean. It's just always a bet, Joe. I understand it's a bet, but look at Vilasevic is improving to the exact hand he needs to. Oh, wow. Okay. Checks a third time. <laughs> Oh, can Vilasevich queen checks queen. back. And you queen check. No, queen. <laughs> and gets. Almost. <laughs> <laughs> I have no problem Stop. with Cohen's spirit. My I have no problem with his antics. No, I like it. But does he realize he could be winning more chips? <laughs> <laughs> He's doing it just the way he likes to do it, Joe. And Cohen's got a pretty one. I think Queen Nine suited would be a very reasonable open. Remember, guys, we are five handed. Ranges are considerably wider as we get shorter handed. Just a ton more action. Playing down to the few remaining players that we have left. Ahuja in the big blind has a very pretty Jack Nine suited, though. Pretty, but dominated. You're always calling here. Well, I hope for his sake it is not a nine high flop. The flop is eight, eight, seven. Just the one diamond and the one club. Action goes check, check. Turn card is the jack of diamonds. Well, domination rotation, however, I would highlight the street flash draw for Lucien Cohen. And he's going to bet it, 1.5. Well, if there's one thing Cohen's been good at for the last couple sessions, it's drilling rivers, and he's got a lot of outs that give him the best hand here going to the river. If we get to the river, because this looks like a raise is coming from a Hoosier. He was counting out a raise. The white chips being worth 500,000 each. Four point one mil is the raise called pretty much immediately by Cohen. Yeah, so actually finding value here, but a lot of ways for Cohen to improve. Boom. And that is the king of diamonds. What did you say, Nick? He has been bouncing cards off the wall when it comes to rivers. And here he catches runner runner to make the flush. And I hope for a who's your sake he shuts down here. Does check. And I think Cohen has a pretty clear value bet now. The question is whether that value bet gets paid off. 8.5 million into a pot of 13.7 million. Hey, my friend, a long time, huh? I mean, this bet is nearly half of Ahuja's remaining chips. If he folds here, he's still going to have 20 big blinds. If he calls, we can see he will lose the pot. He will be in the danger zone. Danger zone! I just think that, I mean, that smaller bet on the turn to me just feels like from a less experienced player, it's going to be happening? very draw heavy. Okay, okay. <laughs> this we can't do. This I don't agree with. Okay, but remember when he did this against Tailka. Hey, mais les bouts de vous, hein? He's screaming, I have a hand. Yes. And if past behavior is indicative of future behavior, Ahuja may realize that. But looks like he's made the call. Again, Cohen taunts his opponent into making a ridiculous hero call and paying off a massive value bet. Do the worm. Lucian Cohen still 
king rat. Yep. Do you know what a rat king is, by the way? I, uh, um, I, I feel like I do. A rat king is a naturally occurring phenomenon where oh, a bunch well, all of rats the rats come together to become to form a, a well, not you know, yeah, it's like not a blob a, of rats. Yes. It's not an actual entity. It's an it's, accident. They mostly yeah. die because they yeah, become they wrap so their tails. Yeah. Yeah, 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 but quite terrifying. Yeah. Also, as a character in uh, Ninja Turtles, if you remember, there was a rat king lived in the store. Queen High Flop, top <laughs> pair for Cara Demos. But Cohen with that hammer, going to be betting quite significant. You can tell, actually, that it represents about 20% of Karadimos' stack. But like Petros has shown a lot of patience and allowing on, his opponents on, to baby. blast off into him when he has a very strong hand. We saw it with the Kings. And this time... With the Queen, again, just going to call. Really brilliant stuff here from Karadimos. Not getting over excited. And I could just see Cohen saying, you know, all in sometimes on this turn card, but is wisely checking. Well, Cohen has one whole card to hit here. Yes. Not one out. But, you know, if Karadimos has a three, is going to fold on the to a shove on this turn for Pot. Uh, a nine, you know, it's not going to be thrilled. And Cohen is going to call with the gut shot. Karadimos just playing this so well, finding a leak. River of card is the Jack oh. of Diamonds. Cohen gets there again. Only. Uh, yeah, oh, there I it is. It. Cohen shoves. Now, every single time we've seen this happen, Cohen has had it. And he has somehow gotten his opponent to call. No, I don't think. I mean, look, if there was a flush draw on the turn, hey, you know, you got to ask yourself, what is my, turn, my opponent turning into a bluff here? Six, seven off? Oh. Sielka did it. Oh. Ahuja did it. My friend. There you might be another one I'm forgetting about right now. My friend, my friend. My friend, my friend. And Karadimos does it as well. Calls it off with top pair. Not even close to beating the river straight of Lucian Cohen, the rat man. Blah, 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 blah. Raises to five million with king eight offsuit. King four for D'Alessio. And he defends the flop, is king high. And right now, Cohen's eight kicker is playing. And that is a not insignificant continuation bet, Griffin. The pot is 12 million. And Cohen has bet 10 million. Oh, wow. And look at this, Delessio rips all in. I don't think Cohen's folding top pair here. I don't think so either. It does represent a great deal of chips, though. 40 big blind shove. There is the call. And D'Alessio is drawing thin. Now, there is a 61% chance that this is going to be the type of pot that everyone yeah. loves. But well, if not, I mean, D'Alessio oh. needs a miracle for very hard to get. A lot of ways for this to get us singing. Yeah, D'Alessio's best chance here is realistically for them to chop it, for that eight to be counterfeited. Any jack or ten will do that right away. Yeah! Oh, it's the eight oh on the turn for two pair. And now D'Alessio can only chop it. Well, it's not over yet, buddy. It's not over. Now it's over. And Lucien Cohen adds an Astraeus title to his EPT title. The so-called Ratman takes down the biggest live tournament in PokerStars history. Besting a field of 7,398. 
to win 776,000 euros. Thanks for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe for more awesome poker content and check out this video. The YouTube algorithm seems confident you'll like it.